and welcome to the Channel 6 5 o'clock evening news for Friday, April 8, 2011. Today, in box office news, the movie I Am Number 4 has climbed to the top of the charts. Wait, I'm hearing that there's a breaking news story going on. Let's go to Brett A. Bear in the field. We're live? We're good? Okay. This is Brett A. Bear from Channel 6 News reporting from the golf course. Mongadorians are attacking the golf course. Sancho, get the Mongadorians in. Sancho, did you get it? Oh, no, sir. Sancho, did you get it? No, sir. I will have you deported, Sancho, if you don't get this next shot. Don't, don't do that, sir. Okay, well, Mongadorians are jumping over 20 feet high. I see them. Sancho, did you get that one? Oh, no, sir. Um, I'm sorry about that, everyone. Fred Bear isn't really our best field reporter. Sometimes he gets a little bit carried away. Yes, clearly it is impossible that these Mongadorians could jump that high. According to the laws of physics, the height of a barrier is different than the height a jumper's center of gravity is. Many people can leap over a one meter fence, but only rarely does anybody raise the center of gravity of their body. Even Michael Jordan can't do that. Sorry folks, we didn't get that last shot because Sancho is a horrible cameraman, but we are determined to get this next one. Hold on, Savannah's trying to tell me something from the studio. No, Savannah, this is real. Megan, this is my story, shut up. Mongadorians are now staying in the air for over three seconds and we are going to get this shot. Oh, sir, we should not be here, sir. It's a private property, sir. Sancho, shut up. We are going to get this shot. Okay, this is obviously a joke because in real life, hang time is actually less than one second. Although it may look like more time is spent in the air, it's actually less than one second. Obviously. Since this story isn't real, let's go to our field reporter in Lincoln Park for a real news story. And Mark, the woman, the victim, tells us that a man broke into her house and tried to rape her. Her brother went in and he tried to help her out, but the man got away, leaving behind, though, evidence of his visit. Kelly Dodson was asleep with her little girl inside their apartment on Webster Drive when I was attacked by some idiot from out here in the projects. Dodson says her attacker used a garbage can to climb onto the unit's ledge, open the upstairs window, and then he got in bed with her. He, he tried to rape me. He tried to pull my clothes off. Dodson struggled with her attacker, knocking over items in her bedroom. Antoine Dodson heard his sister scream and ran to help. Well, obviously we have a rapist in Lincoln Park. He's climbing in your windows. He's snatching your people up trying to rape them, so y'all need to hide your kids, hide your wife, and hide your husband because they raping everybody out here. You got your t-shirt, you done left fingerprints and all. You are so dumb. You are really dumb, for real. You don't have to come and confess that you did it. We're looking for you. We, we going to find you. I'm letting you know that so you can run and tell that, homeboy. Now, if you have any information on this crime, you're urged to call Huntsville Police Department. We'll have much more from the victims of that attack. Stop cutting me off. This is my story, and I will get my big break. Sorry, folks. This is my story, and I'm determined to get the footage. The Mongadorians are jumping over 20 feet high, and they're staying in the air for over three seconds. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Is that Wayne Jenkins? He's dead. Oh, my God. They must have thrown him from over a thousand feet. Let's go, Sancho. Oh, we, we gotta get out of here, sir. It's just a joke. This stuff can't happen. Oh, look, I found something. According to Newton's third law, whenever one object exerts a force on a second object, the second object exerts an equal and opposite force on the first. Therefore, the Mongadorian couldn't have thrown that man a thousand feet without being pushed back by the force. We're hiding from the Mongadorians right now. Sancho, did you hear that? Oh, no, sir. Oh my god, Sancho, they found him! Sancho, <laughs> We're not sure exactly what's going on, viewers. But um, stay tuned and we're gonna figure this out. Sancho just saved my life and stabbed the Mongador and it turned into sand. Thank you, Sancho, for saving my life. I'm going to give you a raise to feed your family of 19. Back to the studio. According to physics, this can't be true. They can't turn to dust that fast. The law of conservation of energy says that energy can't be created nor destroyed. This just can't happen. 
Well, I guess there's some things that just can't be explained. He's climbing in your windows, he's snatching your people up, trying to rape them, so y'all need to hide your kids, hide your wife, hide your kids, hide your wife, hide your kids, hide your wife, and hide your husband, cause they're raping everybody out here. You don't have to come and confess, 